Britain's worst air disaster. A Pan Am 747 jumbo jet with 255 people on board has crashed just north of the Scottish border. It's now known that 258 people died on the plane, at least 15 more on the ground. There's an emergency telephone number in America. Some of them may have been Americans. Uh, we're sending uh, a number of inspectors from uh, our Pan Am certificate office here in New York, and the National Transportation Safety Board is putting together a team as well to go over there. So that would be an indication that Americans would be on board. Uh, we have un no confirmation, no numbers of to injuries or, or fatalities. Pan Am flight PA-103 took off from London Heathrow, bound for John F. Kennedy Airport in New York at 6.25 this evening. And also, the ruins of cars and houses destroyed where the jumbo jet fell. Some seven houses, our latest information, having been destroyed in the town of Lockerbie. And this is Lockerbie this morning, where the hunt, regrettably, is now for bodies. It's no longer for survivors. Radar contact was lost at 7.19. The plane came down in the town of Lockerbie in Dumfriesshire. It crashed into a petrol station and a number of houses. Eyewitnesses report a huge explosion and a 300-foot fireball. There were 240 passengers and 15 crew on board. This was a scene at Lockerbie in Dumfriesshire last night. Burning wreckage from the Pan Am airliner on the ground at Lockerbie in Dumfriesshire. The rescue workers there searching for bodies. I'm standing here in the heart of the town in this sombre and dismal morning. As the light grows, the bodies which have been located will be brought here to the town hall, which has been turned into a makeshift mortuary. Throughout the morning, the search will continue for other bodies from the plane, and also a number of casualties, a number of local people, we can't yet ascertain the number, but some who are missing. In breakfast time, in the next half hour, I'll be talking to local people about how the community is coping with this terrible devastation. It's a few days before Christmas. The residents of a small Scottish town prepare for the holidays. approaching. 